Hey everyone, Geneva Vanderzil here, and today I'm going to be sharing with you a creative and fun idea to make this Mother's Day. I'm always looking for really unique ways to show mum that I care on Mother's Day. Being from a family that loves food, this year I decided to make a photo recipe book with a couple of my favorite recipes and space for her to add hers over time. For this project, I'm using Canon's new Selfie Square Photo Printer, which makes printing your photos at home so easy. There are lots of things to love about this little printer. For one, it is seriously portable. It literally fits in the palm of your hand. It's also incredibly user-friendly because it prints directly from your phone or tablet using the Selfie Photo Layout app. The app also enables you to add all different layout options as well as filters, stickers and frames before you print. Even better, the photos have a 100 year lifespan. At the end of the printing process, the photos are covered by an overcoat finish, which gives them a glossy appearance and also protects them from water and dirt, meaning they're the perfect photos to add to a cookbook with recipes that'll be used all the time in the kitchen. As part of the gift, I thought it would be really nice to give her the selfie square photo printer as well as the book so that she can add recipes with photos over time and also so she can print photos of family, which I know she loves doing. This project is really easy and all you really need is a nice scrapbook, the selfie square printer, and things that you'd like to decorate the book. I used pens and I also like to use a label maker for titles and to make it look a little more professional. The first thing I did was print the photos of the recipes that I wanted to include in the book. I included my grandmother's dal and also my brother's pitta recipe. I also printed some old photos of mum and I and a few other photos that I knew she would like, like some of Frankie and some of the whole family. I then set about decorating the book. I created a cover using a picture of my favorite recipe and then I did a little dedication page as well at the front with a photo of us and a happy Mother's Day message. I then set about inputting my favorite recipes. Adding photos gave it such a professional look. What I did was I put the photo on one side and the recipe on the other side and I tried to stick to that format all the way through the book. What I love about this project is you can get as creative as you like. You can add little drawings, stickers, stamps, you can even stick in ingredients. Once I was finished putting all the recipes and photos into the book, I packaged it up in a really nice box along with the selfie square printer, ready for the big day. I love this gift so much and I just know that mum is going to love it as well. 